Uh, welcome back to another episode video on my channel and in today's video I will be giving you a top 10 list for the captains on one of my favourite shows, one of one of my favourite TV shows, Mind Pony, right here in New York. Let's go. 10. Sunset Shimmer. A villain turned ally to the main six in the human world and a character with one of the best character arcs in Mind Pony history. We first meet, met her in the first Equestria Girls film where she first stole Twilight's crown and then turned into a she-demon and tried to destroy both the human and pony worlds. But after this she is reformed and helps the human main six defeat the Dazzlings. Also known as the Sirens. In Rainbow Rocks, in Rainbow Rocks, Midnight Sparkle in Friendship Games and Gloria today is such guy ever free in Legend of Everfree. So she just about makes his top ten list in ten. Nine, Discord. Just like Sunset Shimmer, Discord went from a villain to an ally of the main six. This time the pony main six. We first meet Discord in the season two premiere when he breaks from prison, when he breaks from his stone prison and steals the elements of harmony, tearing the main six apart. Luckily, the main six yet get back together and, and turn Discord back into stone. Discord then returned later on in the series, where he got reformed, turned his back on the main six by teaming up with Lord Tyrek to help him destroy Equestria, impersonated the villain Grogar and brought together Lord Tyrek, Queen Chrysalis, Kozigo, and King Sombra with Tyrek, Chrysalis, and Kozigo, nearly destroying Equestria. However, after the main six and all of their allies defeated Tyrk, Chrysalis, and Kozigo, Discord redeemed himself for everything bad he did in Friendship is Magic by coming up with the idea to turn Tyrk, Chrysalis, and Kozigo into stone. And because of this, Discord makes number nine on this list. Eight. Starlight Glimmer. The third and final captain is this who went from villain to ally of the main six. This time the human main six. Just like with Discord, we first meet Starlight Gamma in the season five premiere where she stole the cutie marks on the, of the ponies in a small town and replaced them with equal signs. Despite not doing the same to her cutie mark. And after she was found out, she tried to escape the town with the main six's cute marks until he was stopped and had to flee. Starlight then returned in, season, in the season five finale where she tried to prevent Rainbow Dash from doing a sonic rainbow which caused a huge explosion that helped Rainbow Dash and the rest of the main six earn their cutie marks. However, after Starlight Glimmer was stopped by Twilight, she reformed and became friends with the main six and since then she has done nothing but good and finishes here in eighth on this list. Seven. Spike. Nothing much to say about Spike. He's Twilight's assistant and pet dragon. He has a good moments like saving the Crystal Empire and bad moments like getting his greed turn him into a big fire-breathing dragon where he nearly destroyed Ponyville. But overall, Spike has always pulled through and helps the main six. He also has a crush on Rarity, who we will get to soon. Spike falls on this list in seventh, slightly below six. Rarity. There is not much to split the top six, but someone had to come in sixth, and that happens to be Rarity, who for me is the weakest out of the top six, which is the whole main six, and that's nothing to do with Rarity. I just prefer the other members of the main six. Rarity is the element of generosity and is a fashionista and an overall and an overall nice pony. So she finishes. So she finishes here. So she's here, finishing in sixth. Fifth. Fluttershy, she is the kindest member of the main six, and that is shown by the fact that she is the element of kindness. However, she only comes in fifth for two main reasons. One, I prefer the characters above, and she's done some really bad things despite being the element of kindness, and that is why she's here in fifth. Four. Epitech. A country girl with a country girl girl with a big flair and the element of honesty. Applejack has done some good things but some bad things and some bad things, but she will always be super honest if she's made a mistake or done something wrong. She's only in fourth because the three characters above her are slightly better. Three. Twilight Sparkle. Despite being the main six Despite being the main character, Applejack, who we just talked about, has appeared in more episodes. Twilight is not only the main character, but the element of magic and a princess too. 
Over the course of the series, Twilight has done many things, so many things, good and bad, but as the main character, she has overcome the bad things and has become a better pony. Twilight only makes it into third because the two above her are slightly better than her. Speaking of... Two. Pinkie Pie, the element of laughter and my personal favourite character. Over the course of the series, however, there is something about number one that puts her over the edge. Talking about Pinkie Pie, she is the fun and energetic and a blast to be around, so she is finishing second in this list behind... One. Waymer Dash. Without Waymer Dash, there would be no Mad Pony, Princess of Magic. Because without Waymer Dash and her Sonic Rain Boom as a filly, her Twilight Rarity, Fluttershy, that chicken Pinkie Pie, wouldn't, wouldn't have gotten their cute remarks. And there will be no main six. So, Waymer Dash, because of this, is the best character in my 20 Finish Princess of Magic, in my opinion. So, who's yours? Thank you for watching this video on my channel. The second farewell to Gordon's video. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell to catch up with all my latest videos, all my farewell to Gordon's videos. That you will miss. But until then, next time, this has been a journal of mine, and I'll see you later. Peace.